Brady here. Brady Plunkett, the monster guy? I suppose you can call me that. What can I do for you? I really need a monster professional. Things are bad, really okay, bad. Okay, relax. Start from the beginning. It all started at my parents' summer cottage. I caught a tadpole in the lagoon. I got one! I got one! And boy, did he ever grow fast! You must be hungry! Maybe it's because I fed it too much food. It didn't seem to bother him, though, because he ate it all up. Then I left him for the night, and that's when things started to get out of hand. Well, the first move should be to contact the local game warden. That's exactly what my father did! My father called the warden right away. The game warden was really mad, and he went on about how illegal it was to take a tadpole from the Black Lagoon and that my dad could be arrested. My father said that he was mistaken, and we didn't have any stolen tadpoles. But I don't think the warden believed him, because he said he was going to keep an eye on us. I don't know what else to do, so I called you. You did the right thing. I'm on my way. Virgil, it's Brady. Meet me at the bus stop. We're going fishing. Great spot. Wonderful way to relax. And best of all, no monsters. Well, not exactly. What do you mean, not exactly? Huh? Just hear me out. Oh, Yoo-hoo! Yoo-hoo, boys! I'm over here! Man, this is getting weirder by the minute! You the pizza delivery boys? Huh? Mom, they're the monster guys I was telling you about. Oh, but where's the pizza? I ordered it days ago. Such lousy service in the country. So, Stanley, should we get to work? Come on up. No way. I'm not going. Ah, oh, come on. This place gives me the creeps. I'm going home. The next bus is only in four hours. Huh? <sighs> I can't believe you conned me into thinking that we're going fishing. Oh, but we are. I knew there was something fishy about these crumb people. Write it down. Write it all down. Oh, I can smell that promotion. Hey, Brady, would you mind filling me in on what I'm supposed to be fishing for down here? Whoa! Yo, Brady, I think I've got your big, terrible creature. I don't think there's enough here for the two of us, buddy. Aha! That's it! We need to find the second one. What? One's not enough for you? I knew I recognized that high-pitched cry of the lagoon. This monster has a partner, a mate, a better half, a ball and chain. Uh-huh. And? And all we have to do is reunite them, and voila! The job's done. All we need now is bait. Phew! That's nasty. Premium fishing oil. Put some on. You're kidding! Just a dab or so. It's all part of my master plan. You wish! 
Aw, oh, man, this is gross. I think I'm gonna puke. Okay, I'm gonna go to the lagoon and find this creature's partner and transmit the love cries through the walkie-talkie. Huh? Hey, wait a minute. Then what am I supposed to do? You just have to hone in on the creature in the basement, make it listen to the love cries, and then lure it back to the lagoon. What? And how am I supposed to do that? Use the movement detector to zero in on it, and then just wait for the cries. Easy. Think about it, Virgil. This could be your biggest catch yet. know that there's something fishy going on in here. designed amplifier will play my latest in the mood music. Oh, yeah. Works like a charm. The stink in here is worse than the fish oil. I'm out of here. I'm gonna have to rethink this whole fishing thing! This is crazy! Where's Brady? Three feet? Two feet? One feet? That's impossible, man. That would mean... catch you. You thieving thief? We have no idea what happened to those pizza boys. Honest. Huh? I'll take care of this, dear. And just what are you charging me with? For the unlawful engagement of a fiendish creature, which is going to put you behind bars for a long, long time. Where's your proof? All the proof I need is right in here. 
What happened to my notes? I wrote it all down, just like they said at the correspondence course. I guess they forgot to mention to use waterproof ink. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's time we roll up our sleeves and start the cleanup, dear. I hope you learned your lesson, Stanley. You should never take a creature out of its environment. Yes, Mom. You think you can make a fool of 